What now? So right now the well is chlorinated. The pellets are dissolving, releasing bleach, and you want to leave it set for a few hours at least, so it builds up good to kill all that stuff. Mm -hmm. And then after six hours, you can drain some of it off because it's going to redo itself overnight. Mm -hmm. You know, because the pellets are still dissolving, it's still making bleach. All right. And that's all good. That's all good, you know. And then in the morning. It's going to be strong again. Mm -hmm. So, so do we run the water? When do we start the water? Do we run the faucets? About about, about six o'clock this evening. Okay. But you can still flush. Yeah, we can still flush the toilets. Oh, yeah. Yep. And shower, whatever. Well, yeah, but you got to make sure it's not too strong. Right. Okay. You know, and you, that, it's common sense. So, you, do we want to we want to run the run the faucets and stuff till we smell bleach? Yep. Okay. Yep. And, and then shut them off. But by waiting a few hours. Yeah, wait a few hours, then run the faucets to smell the bleach. Yeah, shut it off. And then shut it off. Yeah. And then just wait. Till morning. Till or morning or whatever. Yeah. yeah. 12 to 48 hours, right? Yeah. Or 24. 24 12 to 24 hours, hours. They're supposed to dissolve. Sometimes okay. there's acidity in, in wells. Yeah. Some of them don't have it. Right. Some of them do. Yeah. If it has acidity in it, they dissolve a little quicker okay but yeah still by waiting it it's only going to clean the well right. clean the pipe yeah. clean yeah. you know you, you okay. can flush your toilet all you want and then hot water heater you want some we want in to, that we definitely want to run the hot water in the next few hours to so get it up wait, in there wait a couple hours yeah and then make sure you get enough bleach in there right. just to smell it right okay and then uh for our water softener we want to open that up that, uh, that little lid inside the, take it off, yep. put a half a cup in. Half it, a cup of bleach. It's on yep. bypass, so you can't set the regeneration because right. it's shut off. Right, so we really don't want to open that up until after the water test because mm -hmm. we don't want to worry about contamination and exactly. running through that. Exactly. And we do want to replace that filter. And replace that filter. Yeah, before we do anything, well, before after, we open after it. After the test is taken. Right, right, yeah. Yeah, so we just want to keep that bypass until after the test. Yeah, yeah. And then later on, we can throw that half cup of bleach in, kick it back on, replace the filter. There's so much water in the salt. Yeah. It's, it's not going to work too good. Because okay. the salt level should only be a third of the way up. Gotcha, yeah. By having all the water in there, it might make a bridge. Yeah. Because all that salt, salt's, you know, melt, melt, right. dissolve it. Okay, okay. All right, sir. Thank you much. I appreciate it.